बी विद द टाइम्स छोरों का प्यार बड़ों का प्रणाम नमस्कार सत श्रीकाल आदाब आज सिडनी में जो मेरे साथ पर्सनैलिटी बैठी है उनका नाम लेते ही सबसे पहले पेट में चूहे कोदते हैं उसके बाद मुंह में पानी टपकता है जी हाँ आई नॉर्मली कॉल हेम शेफ ऑफ द सेंचुरी यू गेस इट राइट संजीव कपूर संजीव जी वेलकम टू सिडनी थैंक यू वेरी मच थैंक यू यू नो एज अड यू नो सेलिब्रिटी शेफ of the century <laughs> sanjeev kapoor you know it's an honor and privilege brain thank you so much you been uh, the first celebrity chef when did you realize that you want to be a chef oh actually uh, <laughs> when i got into the profession that's when i re- realized because uh, as a child i didn't even know who a chef was bachpan mein to pata hi nahi hota ki chef kya hota hai har maa baap ko chahiye engineer banega doctor banega is banega pata hi nahi hota chef bhi koi can be a profession so hum to masala dosa samosa wo ek hi punjab sweet house mein khate the to hamare liye to chef wohi hote the so once i started uh, learning uh, this professionally that's when i realized that acha ye kuch alag hai ye kuch ho sakta hai isme karna chahiye and probably you been the pioneer to have this celebrity chef's concept to be started in india uh, if you create a body of work which is worth celebrating to har koi celebrity uh, chef ho sakta hai but aajkal main dekhta hu ki logon ko celebrity chef banna hota hai main kehta hu celebrity chef nahi ban sakte pehle acche chef bano fir baad mein create body of work which is worth celebrating to apne aap celebrity chef so let your work speaks uh, louder than the words so what is the first memory of your career that comes to your mind Oh, many, uh, ha, the first memory of your career, you know? बहुत बहुत सारी बहुत सारी memories हैं। अच्छा। जिसमें but uh, initially जब पहले दिन when I was working I went to do a professional uh, kitchen और uh, तो हमने कहा चलो जाके खाना बनाएंगे and we'll uh, cook this so first day we were given uh, uh, a bucket uh, with a cleaning uh, solution mops uh, to clean uh, the floors and the tiles and everything. Uh, हम सोचे शायद मे बी हाफ एन आवर दैट्स व्हाट वी हैव टू डू बट फर्स्ट फ्यू डेज वाज ओनली दैट एंड दैट दैट्स व्हेन यू रियलाइज दैट ओह माय गॉड इज दिस फॉर रियल दिस इज व्हाट यू वांट टू डू बट देन यू स्टार्ट टू रियलाइज कि ये जो चीज़ें हैं ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट हैं और दिस इज समथिंग दैट इज रियल लर्निंग सो फर्स्ट मेमरीज जो है वो सफाई के साथ में थी वो कुकिंग के साथ में नहीं थी ये जो स्टूडेंट्स आए हैं ये कब तक नहीं नहीं ये तो एक्चुअली इन टर्म्स ऑफ व्हेन यू आर कुकिंग हाइजीन इज सो इम्पॉर्टेंट हाइजीन इज सो इम्पॉर्टेंट एनवायरमेंट दैट यू आर वो सारी चीज़ें जो हैं वो बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट होती हैं एंड यू यू स्टार्ट टू वैल्यू दैम एंड वेन यू स्टार्ट टू लर्न इफ यू पुट that up front uh, that's the best thing that you can do you know normally i ask you know taking back to the childhood mm-hmm. you know there would be many fond memories but which is the one you want to relive out of that see uh, nostalgia is such a great thing mm-hmm. uh, and all the memories that uh, you have as a child related to food are uh, that you live uh, with forever Uh, foods that you at times take for granted foods that you didn't like uh, that also uh, <laughs> you remember and uh, definitely the foods that you uh, remember uh, and uh, i i can say that uh, in um, simple uh, fun of uh, eating all the seasonal uh, things uh, things which are in season uh, my mom is a vegetarian so uh, more vegetarian uh, seasonal uh, food so even even now we would uh, look forward uh, even now i look forward to uh, a good punjabi style curry made by my mom uh, because that that's what uh, we used to have uh, every sunday for lunch uh, kadi uh, chawal yeah kadi chawal <laughs> uh, and uh, so it, it it's funny that how each day of the week was uh, predictable uh, it was kadi chawal for sunday uh, lunch uh, for uh, saturday it used to be chana uh, and uh, rajma chawal whenever there was any celebration i would say that there would be uh, rajma chawal and uh, uh, matlab uh, rajma ne mothi chawal khande se aise you know the moment it comes to punjabi celebration the first thing is eat eat and eat of course hai na i think 10th of april uh, today is your birthday mm-hmm. so on behalf of uh, the whole teams of fiji times uh, friends world tv 
wish you a very happy birthday. Thank you. And it happened to be my daughter's birthday as well on the same day. Yeah, wish her a uh, uh, very happy birthday. So, Jesse, Jesse, I told you, your birthday, I said, okay, it's going to be something. You had a khana khana, which was a super duper hit. Where did the idea come from? So, uh, there was a new TV channel which was being launched, the first cable and satellite television channel of India, uh, ZTV at that time. And uh, uh, they had many shows and one of the shows uh, uh, that they decided was uh, uh, on food. And uh, uh, I was working as a chef uh, in a hotel as an executive chef and uh, uh, they, uh, they came to me with a, with a show and that show at that time was called Shriman Bhavarchi. And I refused. Uh, I said, I don't like the name of the show, uh, Shriman Bhavarsi. And uh, from there, uh, then I suggested uh, a new name, which was Khana Khazana. And uh, so uh, as, a, as a concept, uh, I'm sure it was the producer director at that time of that show, uh, who's now a famous filmmaker, Hansal Mehta. Oh, yes. Yeah, oh, yes. So Hansal, uh, yeah. uh, I would say, uh, food show's uh, idea on ZTV was uh, his idea. But Khana Khazana as a name was uh, something that I gave. You know, basically Khana Khazana, Sanjeev Kapoor are synonyms uh, nowadays. Right. Indian food has already become uh, too popular in the world. And you are one of the key reasons to making it popular by bringing it on the showcase on bigger platforms. How do Sanjeev Kapoor rate his own journey? Uh, so my uh, journey, uh, as I <laughs> say, that it's been, uh, uh, even if I had to uh, clean uh, for first uh, few weeks, even if uh, I had to spend many sleepless nights, even if I had uh, no sleep at times, uh, even if uh, I went through a lot of uh, struggle, I still say uh, it's been uh, the whole journey been uh, like a bed of roses because uh, I have enjoyed the whole journey. I have, uh, I have loved uh, what I have done, I still do. Uh, so for me, uh, it, it's, uh, there's not been a day where I have uh, uh, where I've regretted, there's not been a day where I've said, oh my God, where have I landed? Uh, maybe at that moment I did, but uh, as I look back, uh, I, I think uh, it, it's, it's been dream learning, uh, living. It's been uh, something that I have uh, enjoyed and uh, I think uh, that, that, that's what uh, keeps me going. Wonderful. So struggle has been key to the successes as well. So I normally say, you know, there's no shortcut to success. Struggle is must. That's what you've gone through as well. What are the main factors of success in your journey? So success is, I, I think <laughs> the rules are same. There, there's no, uh, it's... There's no shortcuts. One, uh, of course, there's no shortcut. Uh, all, all the uh, boring things that your school taught you, all the boring things that your parents uh, taught you, uh, they stay true. Uh, uh, I, I would say that uh, for any, any success, uh, uh, you have to, you have to be, uh, you have to make sure that you follow all the principles uh, or the value system that, uh, which includes hard work, honesty, integrity, uh, all, all those uh, discipline, all, all of uh, that is, uh, uh, is a must. Uh, and in that you, you have to uh, have the ability to look beyond what most people can think. Uh, which is a job of a leader, which is uh, uh, if, if you can learn to lead, which means that uh, if you have the courage, uh, courage to do what uh, others may think, oh my God, should I do it, should I not do it, and you actually go ahead and do it, uh, then... More then, the risk, more the returns. Correct. So <laughs> then, then you have the chances of, uh, so if you have the courage to stand out, uh, then the chances of becoming outstanding are higher. So uh, that, that's what I uh, believe in and I have always, uh, I've taken my chances, I've made sure that uh, uh, I open the door uh, whenever there's an opportunity knocking on my door. I'm always there at the door, op open the door. Uh, I just don't wait that someone will open the door for me, no. I, if I have, uh, uh, I think uh, if I come uh, to this, uh, studio you have not come to me i have come to your studio right so this is a when an opportunity knocks you go and uh, uh, make sure that you take uh, that opportunity uh, some people uh, m look at the size of the opportunity but opportunity is such a thing which is always hidden you don't know uh, whether it uh, big or small so don't uh, estimate uh, uh, under or overestimate the opportunity opportunity and opportunity is an opportunity and once again humbled and honored to be sitting next to you. Sanjeevi, wonderful. 
number of recipes have come out of your hands you know the amount of food that you have cooked so far what's your favorite food i eat everything uh, <laughs> my favorite is uh, anything that is uh, that is now i, I don't believe in uh, uh, something which uh, i have eaten earlier i will eat uh, I, i believe that uh, what i will get now would become my favorite for now because otherwise uh, having anything favorite is boring because uh, that means that you have to have that over and over over, over again and that, that's not how uh, life works uh, to uh, we also are uh, not here forever right so to have anything anything be it food person place anything is boring so let's let's make sure that uh, uh, my favorite i i say is now and that can be food place uh, people everything talking about the places right with the amount of workload that you have the amount of commitments you have always traveling working busy with the schedules do you ever get a time for any holidays in between so if, if you <laughs> if you if you can learn to enjoy the moment which is now uh, you're always enjoying uh, so that, that you don't need uh, a fixed destination and say oh this is my a uh, time for holiday what i work when i am working also i'm enjoying mm. right so uh, i'm in uh, sydney uh, so called for work but my family is also here and uh, so i'm enjoying the way i would enjoy uh, harbor bridge uh, opera house i'll enjoy this interview also so what do you call uh, work it is uh, for me uh, I, i don't uh, keep uh, that So no we call it working holidays your holidays are Whatever. working I'm holidays always, i'm always always uh, working i'm always on holiday you know you have managed to win the heart of uh, millions of viewers on the tv and off tv as well what would be the message to all your viewers boy well, i would say that uh, do what uh, what you believe in what uh, what your heart uh, says uh, and uh, stay true to that uh, no matter what uh, things change uh, but be consistent uh, uh, with the uh, what, what the value system that you have and uh, life is tough life is uh, difficult but uh, if you if you start uh, believing in uh, uh, power of uh, now uh, then everything is easy it's uh, uh, you enjoy the moment you enjoy uh, and focus that uh, uh, on everything that is uh, good Uh, unfortunately our mind uh, at times uh, tells us and uh, uh, loses its way and uh, starts uh, we start seeing things not from a positive uh, way of mind we we start focusing on uh, anything that is not good but uh, same thing it's the gla- glass half full uh, or mm-hmm. half empty so i would say that uh, it's better to look at uh, all the flowers uh, that bloom Uh, no, not look at uh, what's not right in the world let's let's focus uh, and collectively make the power of positive thinking so much bigger that uh, the whole um, negativity starts to become smaller and smaller and us who can do it uh, it's it's uh, what we believe in uh, and uh, it's possible I, i can tell you that uh, i i can um, i can live uh, with everything that is good uh, uh forever that that's what i believe and uh, i can say that if i can do it you can do it everyone can do it so dream big achieve big so you you Every, you everything <laughs> whatever you think uh, you can do you'll be able to do so don't don't restrict uh, uh, anything don't uh, uh, no negativity in your thoughts uh, once you start to look at things uh, from a positive way of uh, uh, mind everything will work for you uh, and it's it's very easy it's it's not difficult it's only taking an initiative is the difficult part but once you've taken it you think that it will be done it can be done it will be done that's it perfect perfect so that was the message for the viewers now coming on to there are thousands of uh, young fellows who aspire to be sanjeev kapoor or come somewhere close to sanjeev kapoor so so my <laughs> message for them is don't be sanjeev kapoor be bigger better than sanjeev kapoor wonderful wonderful Wonder Chef, that's a brand, uh, world-class cookware and appliances, uh, recently launched in Australia. Sure. Tell us something about it. 
So, Wonder Chef, uh, it, it, was, uh, it was a dream uh, because I, I believe through my show Khana Khazana when I first started and then Food Food TV channel when I started, uh, I realized that I was influencing, uh, especially in India, I was influencing many uh, women and uh, th- what was uh, happening was that uh, while I was teaching them how to cook, uh, there was a lot of independence that they were getting uh, through that uh, cooking and in some sense it was emancipation of uh, women that was happening and I realized that uh, if I can create more opportunities for them uh, that would be better so uh, I, I uh, thought of uh, something uh, with the uh, 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 current MD and managing partner of Undershare Ravi both of us we realized that we could uh, create something where we would teach women how to cook and uh, we also embedded some products which they could sell and earn more money uh, and that idea uh, worked well so it, it uh, uh, initially started as uh, a program for women to create entrepreneurs uh, through power of cooking and uh, they could sell some products and make money also that's how it uh, started and uh, uh, since then it has uh, grown really well and i'm happy that uh, now uh, Biden has uh, brought them uh, into uh, Australia and uh, I- I'm sure that uh, people would uh, love it uh, in uh, Australia as uh, it has become uh, one of the leading brands uh, in India. Uh, we have been uh, for last, uh, since our inception actually, we have been the fastest growing uh, mm. brand uh, of uh, kitchenware in India. Uh, year on year our growth uh, has been so much. Uh, so I'm sure that, uh, and our products speak for themselves. So they, they, when you start using them, uh, uh, you fall in love with those uh, products. They, they are just uh, uh, products that uh, uh, you will say, you like to cook in. And we built Wonder Chef over three pillars, which we say, uh, taste, health, and convenience. Taste, health, and convenience. So anything that you cook in uh, Wonder Chef uh, products, uh, would turn out to be tasty, will be healthy and be convenient. So that, that's what we focus on and each of our products. Uh, we also help you cook where we give the recipes, uh, mm. how do you cook because otherwise there, there could be something which uh, uh, you may buy and you say, oh, how do I make best use of it? But there are things that you buy but uh, you don't know what to... Uh, so the recipes it. comes with the utensils yes, as well? Yes, mo- most of our products, actually all of our products. Are, uh, and if it is not there, more online you'll uh, get. Perfect, perfect. And the Kazana brand spices, pickles, ready to cook and chutney is also launched in Australia. Mm-hmm. Sure, so uh, that, that's something that uh, we, we do in a, a small uh, way, small scale. Uh, and uh, uh, we don't produce uh, very large quantities of it uh, as... Uh, uh, as yet uh, and I'm happy that uh, Australians are getting to uh, taste it I, uh, wherever I uh, travel in the world and I'm always told oh my god uh, uh, we tried it uh, but uh, now we cannot uh, get it and I, I tell them you know what we only made so much it, it, it's, uh, it's just that uh, uh, I believe that uh, uh, we will we will may start to make them in uh, larger uh, quantities, quantities as well. Uh, yeah. But uh, as of now, uh, I, I can uh, I can tell you, uh, Khazana as uh, products, we we put a lot of uh, uh, work on those. But uh, uh, so for example, in our pickles, we have uh, some seasonal pickles, and they, they get uh, sold like this, and uh, they are not available after a few months. But By the I time can't you do anything because. Uh, I don't want to use uh, anything which is not in season, I, I don't want to do, uh, so I, I would say that uh, if you see a pack or uh, a bottle of uh, Khazana products, uh, buy immediately because the chances are <laughs> that, because that, that's the experience. I know I, I travel to uh, United States and Canada and uh, I, I get this uh, complaint uh, and uh, my team keeps on saying, Let, let's uh, make more. It's a good problem to have. It's a good problem to have. It's a good problem to have. You know, once again, I uh, just wanted to say thank you, Biren, for giving me an opportunity to sit next to Sanjeev Ji. So, today, we have to Sanjeev Kapoor and I'm your Sanjeev Ji. Sanjeev Ji, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Green Big, Achi Big, Jemco Sydney. Any course, any uni. www.jemcoaustralia.com.